So I've got a chance to skate on these blade techs um, probably now four hours in and I am impressed. So a couple of differences I noticed from the Bowers right away. The flex up here that you can kind of see, that cutout, that is no gimmick. That really works. And I will say, I don't know if it's 5% faster or if it's better on your joints, but I noticed an instant difference, um, especially on my first two strides. I really get on my toes. I could feel the holder. It kind of feels like when you have old uh, Bauer two holders and you, you've kind of, had, you know, the skates have seen a lot of love and your blades are a little wobbly. It kind of feels like that, but it's much more confidence inspiring, if that makes any sense. Um, it, it, you'll hear the click kind of like your steel's loose, but unlike your steel being loose like a standard LS runner, I find these to be very comfortable. It's almost like there's a little cushion every time I take a stride. And now that hasn't affected my speed, it hasn't affected my edge or my cornering abilities. Stops and starts feel really good. I'll update uh, a video later with just me doing some inside edges and outside edges. And it they felt fantastic. I was really, really impressed. The other thing, and again, this is gonna be a long-term update, but the quality of the steel just stands out. I can't stress you enough, my LS runners were corroding almost instantaneously. And I actually left these out a little wet yesterday, intentionally, just to see if they'd corrode. There's nothing in there. I mean, you can see on both sets here, these have really high levels of fit and finish. And looking at the edges, you can go down and you see there's very little damage to the edge at all. No folds, no cutouts. I use a 5 8 sharpening, so very shallow sharpening. Um, and these have really held up nicely. We'll do a long-term corrosion test on these to just make sure they hold up, but I have to say, Blade Tech really puts their money where their mouth is. Again, I don't have any ability to scientifically prove their claims, but from the butt dyno, these are great. I would say definitely pick a, uh, a pair of these up, and if you don't like the Bauer Steel, these are a great alternative. Um, again, the Bauer Steel runs, like the way it skates is phenomenal. I really do like how the T Pulse TI Steel skates, but as far as fit and finish, it ain't even close. I would take these in a heartbeat.